Traffic signals are something we all see every day. We all pay attention to them, and we follow the unspoken yet obvious rules they enforce. Ignore them, and it could end in tragedy. Ever since we were young, we have known what these lights mean that we see every day. Their purpose, their meaning, and most importantly, how to follow them. They have always been there, and always will be there. Otherwise, chaos ensues. The thing with traffic, or the traffic of life, is that you never know what is going to happen. You could follow all the rules, go the speed limit, and be a safe driver, but the inevitable still happens. You could be minding your own business, and the next thing you know, you're upside down in the ditch. In life, we have a lot of constants. People, change, chaos. Some semblance of control. That thought of control is what keeps some of us going, being in control, or following the illusion that we are in control, when in reality, we control nothing. Jesus is like a traffic light. He is always there, he is always in control, even when we don't realize it. He has always been there and always will be there. He is a constant in our life, whether we choose to acknowledge it or not. If we listen to it, we get to the next intersection. And at that intersection, there he is. We get to where we're going, where we're supposed to be. If we choose to ignore him, chaos. And that's how most of us are living our lives, in pure chaos. We think we are in control, but that we know what we're doing. We can do this without him. But ignore a traffic light and everything goes bad. You might get lucky and make it through that intersection alive because there was nothing coming. But how many times will you be lucky? How many times will you get off with, that was dumb, but it's a good thing that didn't go wrong? How many times can you ignore the rules before you realize they are there for a reason? If we follow Jesus, things go right. We may not think that's what is right for us, but he knows what is better for us. He knows us better than we know ourselves, and sometimes we do what we are told. We do what he tells us, and someone still t-bones us in the middle of an intersection. But that's life. It's all part of his plan. We have to trust, trust Jesus like we trust the traffic lights we see every day. Jesus is a light in our lives, whether he is a traffic light to us or a wake-up call. He is there to help and guide us, to help us through the chaos of life.